And fifth, my friend's arthritis went away after five, uh, after a few months. So mine will too. Is this true? Uh, first thing I want to say is that not all JIAs are the same. I think some of you, or rather majority of you already know that there are actually seven subtypes of JIA and uh, oligo and antisitis related arthritis, so that's ERA, are the more common ones in Singapore and Southeast Asia. Whereas overseas, it's the oligo and the polyarticular ones that are more common. Um, I, I'll show you here, highlighted in yellow, that uh, here in Singapore would be the first column, 30% are oligoarthritis, another 30% are antisitis related arthritis. So that would already make up about two thirds of all arthritis. Whereas going over all the way to the right here, you find that in the Caucasian population, you will have uh, oligoarthritis followed by um, polyarthritis RF negative subset that are, uh, that are the majority. In terms of the JIA um, gender and profile as well, you'll find that in Asia, which is uh, on the left side of the table, uh, majority are actually males. That is because of the ERA subset, okay? ERA tends to occur more in males. Um, whereas all the way in the Caucasian Middle Eastern side, the J uh, JIA tends to occur in females because uh, again, it's the oligo and polyarticular subset. So why I highlight this here is because sometimes uh, some of us may join some JIA forum uh, overseas and, and a lot of them start talking about their JIA and how it's treated and how it's all uh, gone. Um, um, take the advice or, or rather their ex, uh, personal experience with uh, a bit of a pinch of salt because your uh, subtype and your genetics, just the fact that you are Asian, uh, is, pr is probably going to have a different course compared to the people uh, uh, with a different genetics in the Caucasian and Middle Eastern uh, bloc. The good thing is, the good news here is that in Asia, the rate of uveitis is very low. It's probably below 5%. Uveitis is inflammation of the eye. So if I can highlight to you the second last row at the bottom, our rate of uveitis or inflammation in the eye eyes uh, are, are, are single digits. Whereas in over in the Western population, it's at least 10 to 20%. And a lot of their morbidity or rather problems that they experience are related to vision loss from uveitis, uh, not so much the joint problems itself because uveitis is actually fairly difficult to treat. So in terms of uh, the treatment and the outcomes are also not the same between the subtypes. We're not just talking about between Western population and Asian population, okay? We're talking about within our own Asian population, even the treatment and outcomes are not the same. And we don't really, uh, and we, like, the suspicion and hypothesis is that it's re really related to the genes and how our body reacts and responds to the different types of uh, medications. So we must know that JIA is a chronic condition that waxes and wanes um, and that there is this important window of opportunity that the earlier you receive treatment and the more aggressive you are at the beginning to stop the overreaction of your immune system, it would then help to defer the risk of flare later on in the disease course. In other words, hopefully by being more aggressive at the beginning, we will look to the possibility of actually so-called outgrowing or not having the disease come back again. Okay, I dare not say cure yet, um, but you never know, maybe in 10 years, we'll actually find which gene uh, um, uh, helps to guide us, what treatment will, um, is, is best for this particular person, a little bit like how cancer therapy is heading towards. So with more... Um, uh, science and knowledge, we, uh, the treatment might become more um, customized to the person. Um, and with the current modern treatment, majority will have arthritis that is controlled before one year, which is really good. Previously, uh, before biologics, uh, most of the children with arthritis just, to have, uh, just have to accept that majority of the time they're just going to have uh, in inflamed joints. At best, we can just 
control the pain. Uh, it will just keep being inflamed. Um, but now with biologics, a uh, majority will have arthritis control. Control meaning no arthritis at all, but uh, having still be on medication by one year. 